The other thing is you don't need to listen to every single person. This is just basic criticism 101 where basically, yeah, there are going to be pieces of feedback that are important that you can definitely take and constructively use it for your benefit. But then there's also other types of feedback that doesn't necessarily contribute to your progression. So let's say, oh, that character was red. I wish it was purple. Could help, right? If, if it's like, hey, the contrast makes more sense. And yeah, that's definitely uh, constructive, right? But if it's like player preference, oh, well, uh, whatever, right? But then also there's some comments where, you know, maybe it just has nothing to do with the project, the progress. And, like, you know, not every every single opinion out there actually works. Um, so be careful who you listen to as well, because maybe you do get some really good constructive criticism, but it doesn't align with the end point of your game either. So you just have to be very critical and like, again, careful with it. Right. But just be aware that not every single player, not every single person in your audience knows what's good for your game. So it's good to listen, but select what is actually necessary based on what actually gets you progress and enhances the player's experience.